This dogman sighting comes out of Love, Colorado from February the 9th of 2017. The witness states that he is a 24-year-old, that he lives out in the middle of nowhere, and that he lives only seven miles north of Oklahoma border on 250 acres of land. He says that he has trap lines running around his land for coyotes. Now he was getting home one night late because he had to take his sister to the airport in Lamar. So he needed to check his traps this night. He says that the first two traps were empty, so he headed south to more traps. Now this is when he says he saw this creature. At first he thought it was a coyote, a very large coyote he thought, since this creature was almost five foot tall while on all fours. This creature was caught in one of his traps that it was running around causing a dust cloud. It stopped and just looked at me, he said. Now he says he uses Duke number three leg hold traps so that he can catch a variety of things in them. He says at this point he slammed on his brakes and that his truck stalled out because it is a manual shift old farm truck that the truck backfired very loudly. Now once the creature heard that, it lunged at him and roared. When he noticed that it was caught by its right hand, yes, he said hand and not a paw. The witness seemed to think that this creature was after a dead rabbit he had placed in a bait hole near the trap. Then at this point, the creature stood up and ripped out the two earth anchors he had put in the ground. He says that they were in about 24 inches and that it took him a long time with a 10 pound hammer putting them in. But that this creature just pulled them out in about 15 seconds, he thinks. The witness says that after it pulled out the anchors, that this creature just stood there looking at him, saying that it felt like an eternity to him, knowing that his 357 wouldn't do a thing to this creature if it decided to come after him. Now he says at this point he prayed to God that this thing wouldn't come for him. He says that he was just looking at the creature while in shock and awe that he noticed that this thing had orange eyes. He says that they weren't glowing, but instead they had a tint to them, kind of like a cat's eyes in the dark, which they could have been reflecting in his headlights. That he just wasn't for sure on that one. Now at this point, he says the creature took a step towards him while curling up his upper lip, showing his teeth at him. The witness says that they were huge, saying that the largest two had to be four, maybe five inches. It then growled at him one last time. Then it was gone in a blink of an eye. The witness says that he was scared crapless at this point. Then he got the truck into gear and spun the tires as he was getting out of Dodge. He says that even though this sighting seems to have lasted an eternity to him, that it probably was only 30 seconds or so. Now he says that he returned later with a friend, and that his friend is an Arapaho Indian, and that he trusts him. That he told him stories that was passed down by his grandparents and by his tribe mentioning something about a creature called a loup-garou, or a French werewolf. He also told the witness of how fur trappers were chased off the mountains by these creatures in the 17 and 1800s. So what do you think this witness ran into that night? Drop me a comment down below and let me know. And don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification button. So you can keep up with all our newest videos.
And thanks for watching those endless mysteries.